hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are old here thanks if you are new here please kindly subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified when i upload a new video in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to design a short flyer using photoshop cc so let's get started ctrl n to open your canvas then i'm using 4 by 4 inches then I'll leave your resolution at 300. So copy your color code. Okay, Ctrl V to paste. These are the fonts I'm going to use. Then copy the church name, select your test tool, then change the font to white. Then use Acrobat, make it bold, then Ctrl V to paste. Then apply vertical alignment. Use your arrow key. Ctrl J to duplicate. Copy again. Then Ctrl V to paste. Apply vertical alignment. Ctrl D to deselect. The font name over there is Tuesday night. Copy this color code. Ctrl V to paste. Then increase the size. Okay. Ctrl J to duplicate. Drag it up over here, then you bring it down. Then copy your test, Ctrl V to paste. Then I'm going to change the font to a vertical insert. Then apply vertical alignment, Ctrl D to deselect. Then increase the font size. Come over here to reduce the character space. Ctrl D. It's okay like this. Ctrl J into duplicate. Ctrl C to copy. Then Ctrl V to paste. Increase the font size. Okay. 
apply vertical alignment ctrl d to deselect then scale it out again all right Now apply drop shadow. This, I think it's okay like this. All right, now come back again. Then you copy the dates. Select your test tool. Then you change the color to white. Control V to paste. Now increase it. Then come here, you drag this background. Change it to linear bone. Drag this image, take it up, scale it out, drag it up, it's okay, then apply Gaussian blur. I think this one is okay. Select your gradient tool to blend over here. Okay. Then apply drop shadow. Reduce the spread and the size. Okay. Reduce the opacity to 60. Hold your Alt key and drag the layer style. Select your brush after you create a new layer. I'm going to use this brush. I will leave the brush in the description below so that you can make use of it. All right. Then bring this icon, 
reduce the size then position it over here for now then drag it to the white area Rename it Ctrl J to duplicate it Then copy the time Ctrl V to paste, highlight the AM and reduce the size. It's okay. Then drag the icon, reduce the size. Position it over here. Now go to image adjustment, select hue and saturation. Then you drag it to the white area. Okay. Now duplicate this one again, Ctrl J. Then Ctrl C to copy. Ctrl V to paste. Reduce it so that there will be equal. Now, use your arrow key to move it up. Group it and rename it. Reduce it a bit. Then use your arrow key to move it up. To grist a space. Now select the date and the time. Then you move it up. It's okay. Now, bring this image Reduce the size Okay It's okay like this All right. Now, come back to copy the test here. Select your test tool. Click over here. Control V to paste. Then you bring it down, position it over here. It 
is okay. Then expand it small. Reduce this one. Then copy the name of the pastor. Select your test tool again. Click somewhere here. Then change the color to white. And change the font to have vertical insert. Then paste Ctrl V. Now reduce the font size. Take it over here. Then you bring this one down. Position it around here. It's okay. Then the last thing, copy the location. Bring this icon. Reduce the size. Then drag it over here. Okay, then select your test tool, click Ctrl V to paste, change the font color to black, then change the fonts to this font here, Acrobat, then make it bold. and reduce the size position it well it's okay Then group the location. And group the image. Also group the test here. Alright, now bring this light flare, position it around here, then change it to screen, then duplicate it, Ctrl J, then take this one over here. Okay, now rename it, okay, we are done with renaming it. So now hold your shift plus control plus alt and press E on your keyboard 
So you see what you have. Then go to filter, select your camera raw. Now play around here to set the color of your desire. So after you are done with it, then you click OK and see the outcome. Thank you very much for watching. Remember to like, share, subscribe and comment. So this is the outcome of it. So if you like this video, let me see your comment below.